This is board certified dermatologist Dr. Dina Strawn of Aglo Dermatology in New York, and I'm going to demonstrate for you today a 20% salicylic acid peel. This peel is a bread and butter peel that we do in our practice. It's great for acne, acne scars, blemishes, fine lines, sun damage, and it's a great peel to start with if you haven't had a chemical peel done before. It's also safe on all skin types. Our patient here has already had her face washed and prepped with alcohol. We do the alcohol prep because that strips the oil off the skin, allowing the peel to penetrate more evenly. <clears throat> As I apply the peel, you will notice that a white frost will start to appear on her skin. And this is nothing to be alarmed about. This is just the salicylic acid crystallizing. And what she'll probably start to notice shortly is a stinging sensation, which is going to build and it'll plateau. Again, this is nothing to be alarmed about. You can, you can use the fan if it's stinging you. And that, as that sensation goes away, the peel is over. And then we wipe the peel off with uh, water and put on moisturizer and sunscreen and you're out the door. One to three days later, your skin gets dry and it starts to peel. And the peeling usually ends in about a week. It's very important when, after you get a chemical peel not to use any scrubs or have your eyebrows or lips waxed or use anything acidic on your face. Just a gentle cleanser and a moisturizer with sunscreen. And it's important also to stay out of the sun. In a week, she should have her results. This is Dr. Strawn from Aglow Dermatology in New York. Visit us at www.aglowdermatology.com.